day. It is past the middle of the week. It is past hump day, hump day guys. It's Thursday. So I'm ready to get crafty. Joseph's ready to get crafty. I don't even think Joseph really knows what we're doing today, but that's okay. So we did not have a finished project for you all today because we couldn't find any more of these awesome little wood pieces that are in the shape of a little egg. So it's going to be like a little uh, one hit wonder today. It's going to be trying it out with you all and with uh, me, but I'm pretty sure it's going to go pretty, pretty well. So we will see, but we're going to make a cute project today. I'm, I'm glad we don't have a finished one for you guys today. Cause I think sometimes it gives a little too much away. Like sometimes you want to just jump on in the live stream and see what the mystery project is going to be. But guys, as always, let me know where you're visiting from. Let me know what you've got going on. Tomorrow is Friday. I'm super excited for it to be Friday. I know Joseph is too. Um, so let us know what you got going on, guys. Today, we're just going to get crafty. And it, it's going to be a pretty chill day. You know, I feel like we've been hitting it pretty hard this week. So today and tomorrow, I think we're going to be a little more laid back, a little more chill. So let me know any kind of questions you all have. Just be thinking of those. Ask them. Joseph is more than happy to ask me the questions. And we've got the door open here in the studio today. It's a beautiful sunny day. So we're just rolling with it, guys. We're just rolling with it. And it's 20% off. The membership is still 20% off. So that is super exciting. So if you do not have a membership, go get one. It is for an amazing die cutting community called makersgonnalearn.com. If you have a Cricut Maker, a Cricut Explore Air, Explore Air 2, Brothers Scan and Cut, Silhouette Cameo, no matter what you've got, you will absolutely adore this membership. We have over 800 digital cut files for all of the tiers of membership, as well as an awesome Facebook group that's super exclusive to this membership with 2,500 other like-minded crafters that love to just get crafty and get creative like you all do. And if you want to become a yearly member, which number one is the best bang for your all's buck. And number two, it's the best because we give you every resource we have to give. You get awesome printable guides. You get uh, fonts, over 80 fonts, and more are added every quarter. And more cut files are added every month. You also also get three uh, free e-courses with the yearly membership. It's for mastering your machine, for design space, mastering design space, and how to build a business with your die cutting machine. And that e-course goes along very well with our free commercial license we offer our yearly members because you can sell what you make uh, and profit off of it, which is amazing. And not a lot of memberships give you all that free commercial license. Usually it's a free personal use license. So for like friends and family, but not for profit. So it's really awesome that we do offer that. So if you have any questions, the link is in the very first, uh, the, it's the very first link in the description below. And as always, Joseph uh, is in there as Tanner, popping in those links in the comments too. So if you want to get that, go ahead. But Joseph, who do we have joining us? What's going on? We got a lot of them. Um, Laura says, hello. Laura says, you look so cute. Uh, Melinda says, good morning, everyone. Marcy says, hi, Rachel and Boy. She, hi, Rachel and Boy. You remember? <laughs> well, thank you so much, guys. It has been a crazy morning at work. I have been editing videos. And I don't know if any of you know how to edit videos or anything about it, but I feel like time passes fast with no other task like it does editing videos. I swear I was looking at my clock and it was 8.15 and I looked back again, it was 10.30 and it was time for me to come over here and get ready for the live with Joseph. And I mean, I was just, I was running out the door. I put a hat on today, guys. I didn't fix my hair. I put the same shirt on that I had yesterday. So I'm sorry guys, but I was, I was too busy uh, editing awesome videos that you all are going to enjoy on the Facebook channel or Facebook channel on the YouTube channel soon enough here in just a few weeks. So I was running out the door, but good morning guys. I can't believe you remember that I called Joseph boy. I have a terrible habit of doing that. And I guess it's kind of, it's, you know, a fun little cute thing I've always done, but I could not get out of the habit of it. And also just another cute little thing is when we were growing up, I would call him boy. And he will call my mom Beck Beck. Her name is Becky. Yep. And that's what she could do. That's what Joe could do. He could say Beck Beck. So, I, I mean, I, I haven't heard him call her Beck Beck in a while, but I'm sure it'll slip out every now and again. Oh, it's, yeah. it's just oh, yeah. like ingrained in your head. Right. It's just the family of it. But yeah. anyways, guys, I'm super excited to be here and to make this awesome little project. So I'll give you like a brief description on what it's going to be. So 
We are going to cut out an outline from one of our awesome collections. It's actually last year's uh, spring collection. We're going to um, contour out a cut file and have a little bunny outline that we're going to cut in vinyl and we're going to place on our little egg here. And then we're going to use some spray adhesive and some glitter. I think you guys know where I'm going. And then after we do the spray adhesive and the glitter, we're going to peel off the vinyl and reveal a beautiful little bunny outline in glitter. So it's going to be super cute. So I can't wait to jump into it. But guys, do we have any questions so far, Joe? Anything? Um, Raylan has one. Okay. She said, I have a question. If I'm cutting on the maker, adhesive full, I have cut it even with a deep knife, but when I go and tear away the negative space, it seems like it's not cut. It seems like it's not cut. Okay, that is a good, that's pretty good. So just a couple things. I don't know a ton about what you're doing. I wish that I was there watching you to try and help you a little bit more. But make sure that your blades are sharp, even if you are using the deep cut blade. Make sure that you, you're on your correct settings and design space. Make sure you're using a good brand of adhesive foil. I don't know if you're using the Cricut brand or maybe it's another brand. Um, so, you know, just cross all your T's and dot all your I's. Make sure your design space is in the correct setting. You know, make sure your blade is all the way down in the housing. You know, make sure it's on the mat correctly and... You know, just different things like that. Make sure you're using a good brand of iron-on, or excuse me, of adhesive foil. Um, but really, I don't think it's user error. You know, just try and go through in your mind if there's anything you could possibly do to uh, make that not uh, successful for you. But that is a good question. Yeah, that's just some tips that I have. Anything else, though, Joe? Um, Kim says she's waiting for her cricket maker to come. Oh, my goodness. You will adore it, guys. Uh, so the first cricket I ever learned to cricket on was the Cricut Explorer Air 1. And I don't know if you guys like jumped from that one to the maker, but when I had the Explorer Air 1 and I learned how to, you know, use it with the dial and everything like that. And then when we unboxed our maker, guys, it was like a whole new world. It was intimidating at first as a lot of things that are out of your comfort zone, a lot of new things always are, but it is amazing. The adaptive tool system, what it can do and what it can cut and how smart it is and how sleek the design is. And this awesome dock where I can just pop my iPad in the a USB port where I can charge it uh, through the day. They have really thought of everything with this maker and I don't really know how they could do any better. I don't even, I have no idea how they could make a better machine than this one, the Cricut. I mean, Cricut's already blew it out of the park with this one, but I can't wait. Let me know when you get your maker. And listen, if you're not already a member of Makers Gonna Learn, then I urge you to join because it is 20% off through the week. But while Tanner is gone, uh, while the uh, cats away, the mouse will play. So we are going to give you guys 20% off through this week. And we have been, we've been pumping that up a lot for you guys because we want you to get that. But you get a ton of stuff. You get all the cut files like the ones you'll see us use today and in all of our YouTube videos. Uh, you get awesome uh, free guides here. If you are a yearly member, this is 20 pages long. It's got um, awesome, it's got, um, what are they called? terminology that's the word it's got terminology if you you know forget kind of some design space terms it's perfect for beginners too that are just starting out and experienced crafters like myself who just reference this for a little a little pick me up a little reminder throughout the year throughout the week things like that um, it has awesome blade charts that show you what each of your blades can cut which is super super awesome and it has a uh, heat charts um, along with these cool little mat charts that shows you what material to cut on which mat um, it has heat charts for your easy press or for your iron and things like that that are going to give you the most success for those projects. And you get cheat sheets for uh, adhesive vinyl, iron on, and printing cut, just complete how to tutorials. And of course, you get more term glossaries because those are great. But this is 20 pages of like me and Tanner in your back pocket for those yearly members, along with fonts. Guys, let me grab this font sheet over here. You guys will love seeing this. But Joseph, let's whip it to the other camera. So they can see these awesome fonts but here are some fonts that we have got for you guys we only have 84 right now i say only like 84 is not a ginormous number 84 is a ton of fonts we have 84 fonts right now to date more are added every single quarter so more are going to be added uh, next month actually guys so stay tuned for that we have so many uh, favorites already from this um, collection of fonts that it's going to be really really hard to see which ones we like from the other new ones coming out, but we're excited for the challenge. But anyways, guys, let's go over here. Careful, and, hey, oh, 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 right, right. Uh -huh. I got you, I got you, I got you. Joe's not gonna let me do that. I'm terrible uh, for that. Yeah, we're gonna be go careful here. all we can. 
Yes, we got to be careful. No. So I'm going to hit YouTube and I'm going to show you guys how to get your 20% off if you are interested in getting your membership and getting, if you want to get a year membership, then you will get access to all of these fonts. You will get access to the free printable guides. You will get your free commercial license. You will get uh, three free e-courses. You will also get the 800 plus digital cut files that are added to every month, just like all the other tiers. And you'll get that awesome Facebook group. You're going to get a ton of good stuff, guys. Uh, so Nikki asks, how long is the membership on sale for? The membership is on sale just through the week, guys. So Tanner is coming back uh, Saturday, so he may let it run through Sunday, but I don't know, guys. Uh, the last day that I'm going to be here is Friday, and I I, I said I'm going to run the uh, sale till I am gone. So maybe it's going to end tomorrow, and maybe it's, he's going to extend it through Sunday. But after that, guys, it is going bye-bye for a long time. I will just go ahead and give you guys that PSA. It's The, the sales are going bye-bye. So get that while you can let's say maybe you get paid on fridays like uh, like i do you can go and get that uh tomorrow so that is great but if you want the membership if you want to see it if you want to um learn some things about what it's about joseph is going to pop that link in the comments but here in the description in the first link down here uh, it should look something like this and if you guys want to uh, open up that description right here you can see a little triangle and just press that and here you can see the very first link with all the little confetti emojis. And then Joseph just dropped that down here. You're just going to tap on that and open that up. And it is going to take you to the page to sign up. Now this is an old page, I will say. We have revamped the site and we are launching it um, later on this month. It will be, uh, it'll be a few, a few more weeks, guys. But uh, we do have an awesome page to show you all. So this page is only if you want to get that 20% off. Right after this, I will switch over and show you guys um, all the awesome stuff you can get with the uh, membership on the new site. So this is just for if you want to go get the 20% off. So you can scroll down here and pick your membership tier. Let's say you just want to get be that yearly so that you can get all the bang for your buck and all the um, great resources we have to give. So it'll just redirect you here to PayPal and you can pay uh, with PayPal or you can subscribe using a credit or debit card. Um, so guys, I'm going to go in design space and we're going to get crafty now. And then after this, while, while maybe after this is cutting or something like that, I'll show you guys the awesome new uh, site page that you guys can see. So Joseph will drop that uh, later on and then I will walk you guys through that. But anyways, so we're going to go here. Oh, before I get started, I know I've been yammering on. Joseph, do we have any questions or anything? Um, I need to ask, what size tablet are you using and what kind is it? Okay, so this, wow. Uh, Joseph is way more tech savvy than I am. I think <laughs> just by hearing Tanner answer this question so much, it's just the regular, and does that mean 9 inch? What is it, Joe? Uh, 9.7. The, the new iPad is the name of it. The, the new iPad. It's just iPad. the iPad. And it's the sixth generation. I do know that. It's just the 32 gig. Uh, and how long did you say this was? 9.7. 9.7. Thank the Lord Joseph is here. Um, <laughs> it's not the pro or anything. It's no, just the no. IPad. Yeah, it's just the regular. We just use it for crafting, guys. We picked it up at Walmart. I didn't even know you could buy iPads at Walmart, but you can. But this is just here solely for crafting. And we get a lot of questions, guys, on why we use the iPad and when are we going to switch back to using some desktops uh, for these videos. And, guys, I hate telling y'all, but our straight up and down camera just gets this so quick and so easy. And, excuse me, it's a lot harder to... Uh, get you know the screen with with the videos on our desktop or laptop or things like that so we are probably going to stick to using our ipad mostly but if we're using the knife blade or this or that we will have to get out our uh, computer or laptop because as you all know if you all own the maker you cannot use your knife blade with the ipad but anyways guys so we're just going to go here to upload and we're going to browse files and we are actually not going to look up the easter collection from this year we're going to look up the spring collection from last year, throwing it back, guys. So we're going to look at the PNGs just so we know what we're looking at. But here are some awesome little uh, files that we had from last year. And I told you guys we were going to incorporate some from last year into this year's because uh, last year's, I just, they hold a special place in my heart. I absolutely love uh, last year's spring cut files. So there are two that we could use for this. I'm wanting to use this little bunny, as you can see right here. There's a plane. Is that a plane going by? Uh, I think it's a car. You guys might hear. Trash truck. I don't you know. You might hear like a garbage <laughs> truck or a plane or something. We'll shut the door if it gets too loud in here if you guys comment that you can hear it. But it's just such a pretty day. I didn't want to shut us in here 
Um, but anyways, guys, so you can use this file right here. It won't let me, you know, I'll, I'll get it closer for you guys. You can use this file right here or you can scroll on down and use this file. Now, either file that you choose, you have to do some contouring, so it really doesn't matter. So we're just going to use uh, this other one that we showed you today. We're just going to use that one here. Oh, wait, I think I picked the PNG. Yep. Discard changes. Let's go. I forgot to go back and then get the SVG, which it really doesn't matter. You know, it's not that big of a deal. So you can totally do that if you want to. But I'm just going to go to the SVGs um, just so we don't have any extra steps to do here. Oh, I didn't even look at the number. Joe, what am I doing? <laughs> okay, the number is nine. Okay, so we know the number is nine. Let's go here. Two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, yay. We found it. Uh, Trisha asks, do you know the reason why you can't use a knife blade with the iPad? Um, so, uh, that's a good question. That's really loud, yeah. I think, Joe. Uh, I, I don't know the reason why you cannot. I just know that, like, if you go on here and you load in your mat and you go to select your materials, if you try and search um, the chipboard or balsa wood or basswood or anything like that, your, cre uh, your iPad is like, whoa, hold up, no. And you just can't select it. And me and Tanner have fallen victim to a lot of times getting all the way this far and then having everything loaded and trying to select a material and realizing, ugh, we can't use it on here. And I don't know if it's because it, um, it uses so much pressure. I'm not really sure because you can use uh, some of the other adaptive tools with the iPad as well. But that is a good question. I don't really know exactly why you can't. I just know you can't. But do you have any other questions though, Joe? Um, Danielle asks, hi, I'm a new annual member. How do I access previous files that are not in current collections? Um, so, honey, those are all the files we've got. We have, I, th I believe it's 19 collections to date, along with the fonts. Congratulations on your membership. I hope that you all are enjoying it tremendously. And you said you were an annual mem member, so you do get those awesome e-courses. You do get the awesome fonts. You do get um, the printable guides. So, congratulations. I hope you're enjoying it. But all the collections you do have access to, and that is all of the cut files. We never take away cut files. We only add to, um, we only add new collections. So we never add or subtract to the collections that are already made. So um, unless you have a more specific question or if I didn't answer it properly, please uh, let me know and Joseph will be happy to expound on your question so I can help you further. But no, we, uh, we just add more collections every month, at least 30 to 40 cut files. Um, and this is from our last year's collection, our spring collection. So all we want in this, guys, is this little bunny. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over here to Actions and hit Hide Contour. And we're going to contour out, pinch to zoom is what it says. We're going to contour out all of these uh, words here. We don't want the Happy Easter. We just want our little uh, outline of our bunny. So we are just going along and see how easy that was. So now if we just go back, then right here's our little bunny. And we are, since we are going to use this as a stencil pretty much, we did choose a color of vinyl that we do not use very often. So this lime green definitely fit the bill for us. So we're just going to measure this and we're going to measure. So we actually, I really want to use this exact piece and we only have seven inches of it. So to make it, um, to just be better safe than sorry, I'm going to do 6.75. And I have measured that on our little uh, wood egg, and it should fit pretty well. So instead of measuring it today, although please measure all your projects, guys, especially if you don't have a, like a scrap piece of vinyl you're going to work with, uh, we're going to go over here to edit, and the width we're going to work with is going to be 6.75. Okay. Oh, I put it 6.7. Hmm. 6.75. There we go. And I do realize now that the height is way too much for this. But good thing, this is a pretty good file to be able to unlock and manipulate. So the most we can work with with our egg, let's see how big, how long our little egg dude can be here. So if we're working with that, it can be like 10, 9, 10 inches long, which is pretty good. So let's see if we unlock this and go to the height, then we're going to go in there with 10 inches. Oh, that's not bad. He's just a little pudgy bunny. That's cute. Do you think that's okay, Joe? Yeah, he's cute. I love the little pudgy bunny. He's cute. I think he's adorable. So I'll unlock it just a bit and slide him in to make him just a hair more slender. But I think this is going to be super cute. 
So once you have this sized, guys, you can just go ahead and click make it. Joe, do we have any questions? Um, Danielle, the same person as earlier said, are they all in the collections on the website? There's no hidden files or anything? No, there is not. We, we're not going to hide anything from you, especially since you are our highest tier of membership. You do get access to everything we have to offer. We hold nothing back from you. And what's her name, Joe? Uh, Danielle. Danielle. We hold nothing back from you, Danielle. So you get everything we've got. So because you are a yearly member, your dashboard is chock full with stuff and we do not hide anything from you. If you have not already, scroll down all the way to the bottom of your dashboard and go and answer this three questions so you can be uh, into that amazing Facebook group. But other than that, you're good to go. Definitely. So we're just going to hit continue. This is vinyl, so we do not need to mirror our image. Thank goodness. Uh, Candace says, I haven't had the funds to join the membership yet, but I definitely will be. I love these guys and girls. I'm a new cricketer, and I wouldn't spend money elsewhere. Y'all are great. Oh, my gosh. What's her name? Uh, Candace. Candace. That is so sweet of you to say. And we are running a sale now, Candace. I do. I, I'm just going to go ahead and say it just because I really want to give you guys uh, the, the PSA. I really do not think that this membership is going to be on sale for a, a long time. We're getting, we're, we have a lot of new stuff coming up for you guys and we're, we're really going to work on um, building the membership up at a standpoint of value because um, I feel like, me and Tanner say it all the time, the membership is worth every penny full price. So guys, there's really not going to be any more sales uh, for quite some time. So Candace, I think it said, as you said Candace, I really, if you do not have the money to purchase the uh, membership right now, I'm, I'm very sorry. Maybe try out a monthly membership if you can, but yearly is most definitely the way to go. But that is so sweet that you wouldn't spend your money elsewhere. And I'm so glad that even though guys, members, uh, some members uh, that can't join just yet, still follow us along here every day and watch all the craftiness that we've got going on. And I just love that. So thank you, Candace. That really shows how loyal you are. And that means so much to us. So now that we're here, guys, we're going to go ahead and press vinyl. We are going to go ahead and give that some more pressure here. That's super important. And now, guys, all we have to do is load in our mat and press the flashing cricket button. So we already have this scrap vinyl loaded onto our mat here. Um, it's just this lime green, and it's very slick. It makes you want to think it's a different type of uh, vinyl, but let's cross our fingers that it works good for today. So we're just going to load this into the machine. And again, guys, I'm not going to make my iPad <laughs> mad like I did earlier this week and try and show you all some things on a different tab. So be asking questions. Joseph will be uh, keeping those up. And uh, I'm just going to press that flashing cricket button. And you guys just hit me with some questions. What have we got going on? Uh, let me know if you have made anything crafty these past couple days. Joseph, what have we got? Any, um, anything Paula going? says, I'm new here. What exactly is the membership and how much is it? That's a great question. Okay. So the membership, it's called Makers Gonna Learn, and um, the link, Joseph will drop that link in the comments for you, and it is also the first link in the description below. It is a die-cutting community, that's what we love to call it, and really the goal for us in our business is to help you guys stay creative with your die-cutting machines. So whether you have a Cricut Maker, a Cricut Explore Air, Explore Air 2, a Brother Scan and Cut, a Silhouette Cameo, or anything like that, you will absolutely love this membership. So Joseph, switch it to this other camera and I'm gonna dive into that amazing, um, that amazing new um, site, uh, little page we got going. And Joseph will also throw in the link to this site page. If you want 20% off, click the link in the description below. But if you just wanna see what's happening on this brand new uh, site we've got going on, you can look at this page here. And so, we just want to help everybody get crafty and we have three membership tiers which is a monthly a six monthly and a yearly but the yearly membership is the best value for you and you get the best bang for your buck and you get so much guys we don't hold anything back from our yearly members and here on this brand new uh, site page you can really see um, what the yearly membership will do for you and your crafting and maybe your future business with this so you, if you were a yearly member, you get 80 fonts and new fonts every quarter. You get that free commercial, excuse me, license so that you can make money with your Cricut. You get three free online classes. And guys, here it says it is on a $150 value, which is totally true. So you are paying less for the membership than you are paying 
for all that you would be paying for all those courses but you get those for free and we have some awesome little um, cut files here that you can see what we have going on there's some awesome little testimonials and some YouTube videos and here we just lay out the membership tiers once more for you guys and we have little new banners like this one that says new fonts are available exclusively to yearly members and we love that we have added these uh, project inspiration photos here for you guys so you can just get inspired and see what projects you could make with this type of membership we love all the testimonies we've got going on here we have a page of what's included at every level so whether you're a monthly six monthly or a yearly you get brand spanking new files every month at least 30 to 40. you get access to that exclusive facebook group you get workshops full tutorials on this new site which is amazing you can just click that link if you want to join but don't click that link go in the description below and get the 20% off link so that you can join for 20% off and guys if you want to be a yearly member with 20% off it is only 42 cents a day guys that is awesome so and then here of course like we mentioned before is our awesome free is sticking together our awesome uh, Cricut printable guide that of course is free um, with um, all of our members at the moment uh, so here it is it's like 20 pages and again I'll just quickly skim through this you've got the terminology you've got the knife blade charts you've got um, let me see here uh, which mat to use what material with the temperature charts you've got the cheat sheets for adhesive vinyl iron on print and cut more term glossaries awesome stuff like that so you can just sign up and download that we have awesome FAQs that a lot of people want to know like how many files are there when will I receive my files? Uh, what can I expect in the private Facebook group? Is my personal information secure? All these are amazing questions we get all the time and we do want to answer. And here is really how the uh, yearly membership is laid out. And you get so much with that yearly membership, guys. We give you all the resources we have to give. We love all these testimonials. And then here is like a little breakdown of all those three free e-courses that I mean Tanner preach about that you get with that a yearly membership. It's for uh, your Cricut, the design space, and how to build a business using your die cutting machine. And you use that along with your free commercial license to make so much money with your Cricut. And I love the membership levels and here is just another awesome little visual aid to see uh, what you get with each tier of membership. And also guys, in this new site, we're super excited because new members that uh, haven't joined yet that are very curious and uh, eager to join do get a free cut file to like try before you buy because i love trying before i buy you know i'm i like to make sure that i'm going to get something of value and this guys is one of my favorite cut files ever this is my laptop i love this laptop it's from the makers collection and it is amazing so guys that about is the spiel i'm just going to unload my mat here and we're just gonna um Peel this up we don't need to like weed it technically and we really don't need any transfer paper for this but after my spiel joseph is there any questions or anything um tanya says rachel you look tan girl <laughs> mm. thank you all so much um it's actually a self tanner so here's the deal guys joseph you can just go ahead and switch camera angles because I, I gotta be in like speech mode here so um and also i'm just peeling this up guys but it's cut so we're like this is all it does here <laughs> but uh, it, it's actually self tanner guys because okay I'm breaking it down for like the past five years I've been super obsessed with the tanning bed okay and I know I know skin cancer central I'm just laying in the bed to hurt myself later I know but it's just something about it it's 20 minutes a day that my phone is off and either music is playing or I'm just kind of thinking or I'm praying and it's just like so peaceful and warm and my eyes are closed and then when you get out you feel beautiful so I absolutely love the tanning bed but this year guys I really wanted to make it a good mission to uh, treat my skin better and to treat myself better and of course that doesn't mean that you are like a bad person or anything if you go to the tanning bed I'm jealous I absolutely love the tanning bed but I set out on a mission this year to um, find a really good self tanner and like a self tanning regimen so I did that I got some at a local shop uh, here well it's not local it's Ulta okay Ulta so I got some at Ulta and I was you know researching a lot and I really like it I like the way it looks it looks really natural this is a loving tan brand um, not sponsored 
<laughs> but you I wish moved, I did. You, you wish. Yeah, 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 I do. But yeah. it's really, really nice. It, it's a mousse, so it goes on pretty smooth. But as far as like self tanners go, I, I've been really enjoying this one. It stays on super well, and I have no complaints. If you guys, if you guys or gals have any questions about that, let Joseph ask them because I love my self tanning routine. I still miss like being in the tanning bed and things like that just because I enjoyed it so much and it was like my me time if that makes sense. But I know it's way better for your skin. But I was, I've always been like scared of spray tans. You know, like I don't, I don't, I've just never gotten a spray tan. But this self tanner, I feel like really works. So this is just what I'm doing this year, um, just to try and stay a little healthier and not get skin cancer. But thank you so much for saying I look tan. Thank you so much. But guys, so this wood, you do not have to do this step and go ahead and put alcohol on here. But I'm going to uh, just to kind of like eliminate the possibility of our vinyl not sticking properly otherwise. So I'm just going to wipe this down here and then allow this to dry a little bit because this is wood and you don't have to do this you really don't and you guys can feel all the materials yourself if you feel a material and you're like oh honey that does not need to be alcoholed then don't alcohol it you know but we're just doing it um just for like literal safety reasons just in case <laughs> uh, gomer but, says what is, the, what is the name of the tanner do you always turn orange i always turn orange well see uh, i was so afraid to turn orange. I was so scared to turn orange. So I really did a lot of research and things like that. So I, the two that were very recommended was, oh man, I'm gonna, uh, Tropic, what it was it? It was like, it was some, I can't remember. Don't the name. ask me. <laughs> I can't remember the name of that one. I wish I could. It, it was expensive though. But the one I use is Loving Tan and they have like a dark and an ultra dark. Um, I get the dark, but I put two coats on my legs and just one coat on like my arms and you know the rest of my body and my face and stuff but I do like my legs to be a little bit tanner uh, than the rest of me because that's just normally how I tan my legs are always tanner so it's loving tan I get the dark um, you get an applicator mitt definitely get that or else your hands will get all uh, you know dark but it, it's never turned me orange even the very first time I did it I bought it in like February and I was like I'm gonna do this now so that if I fail I can just cover up my orange body but it really looked super super good I really enjoyed using it I might try out uh, one or two other uh, brands uh, maybe after this one's out but I have nothing to complain about with this brand I really don't but Joe if you want to switch to the other camera you can totally continue to ask some questions. I'm just gonna widen this out here and lay on our little bunny. Um, Hannah asks, when is the print and cut products video releasing? Print and cut products video releasing. Do you all, do you mean the print and cut, um, I'm trying to think of what they're talking about. Do you mean the print and cut uh, or printable iron on video maybe? Maybe that's what you mean? Maybe? She's, print and cut. Hmm. She says anything, I'll let you know. Okay, yeah, let me know. How does this look, guys? How does this look? Um, Bridget asks, what did, what did you guys use to clean your mats? What do we use to clean our mats? That is a great question. So go over after this video, of course, you wanna stay tuned for this crafty fun, but after this video, go on over to Tanner's channel and just search cleaning mats or how to clean your Cricut mats. Tanner has a whole video laying out exactly how to clean your mats from A to Z. The product we use is only $1 from the dollar store and it's amazing. We, we show you how to, you know, spray them, let them soak and then uh, scrape them and everything. So it, it's, it's an amazing video and go check that out. Good question though. We love talking about cleaning our mats. So where did you get your wood at? Everyone, 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 okay. So this at, was yeah. from the dollar spot at, um, Target, of course. So here, right here, if you guys want to take your picture, screenshot it now. It was just $3, but the problem is we could not find any more of these. We must have had some people already running around to get crafty with these because we could not find them. Uh, we had this one here from last year. So all I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to get a poster board, and I'm going to lay a poster board underneath this. Now, this, this poster board has been through the ringer, that is for sure. But... We really want to protect our table, especially this newly uh, sealed table like me and Joseph have done. And we're going to use a spray adhesive here. Now this spray adhesive is just an all-purpose spray adhesive, the Krylon brand. We love this brand. Um, I actually have a video coming out on how to make reusable stencils with your Cricut. 
Um, and we're using this same brand, but it's a different type of spray adhesive. It's like repositional spray adhesive. But for this project, you want regular spray adhesive. You want it to be strong and a permanent bond, just like Krylon says. So, do we have any other questions, Joe? I don't believe so. Carola says, hello from Germany. I just received my maker yesterday. You all are so helpful. Oh my gosh, we're so glad. And please, I know that you're from Germany, but do not think that you cannot have a membership with us here. It is 20% off as well, uh, just through this week. It's the first link below. Please go get yourself a yearly membership for 20% off uh, because we do have members from, uh, I think we do have some from Germany. We have some from uh, other places like the UK, uh, Canada, and things like that. So please feel free because everyone needs to get crafty all around the world. So welcome, welcome to the channel. And please get you a membership if you haven't already. But guys, so this is stuck beautifully on here. So I'm kind of nervous, but you know, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna just spray it down with our spray adhesive. Not a very light coat, but not like a super thick coat. Like I'm not just gonna sit here in one spot and just like slowly go about it. Um, and then I'm gonna go in with this pretty pink glitter and I'm just gonna glitter it up. Now it's gonna look like a hot mess, guys. I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you but no fear. So I'm gonna spray this and I'm actually gonna flip this, uh, this poster board over to a cleaner side so we can collect our excess glitter. So no worries guys. Can you get up and personal with the spray adhesive so everyone can see that's what I you're can. using? I can, yes I can. Thank you so much. I'm bad about doing that and you guys really wanna know this and I do too. I'm so this type of person. If I watch a video and they're like, oh my gosh, you know, I didn't even get to see that brand, it makes me mad, so I'm sorry guys. But here it is if you wanna see the little label. There's your little label. Take a picture. <laughs> but here it is. It's just the Krylon brand uh, spray adhesive all purpose. And uh, 7010 is the number on this one. Um, so yeah, it's just, just the normal Krylon spray adhesive. So I guess I guess better late than never. We're just going to go for it, Joe. I uh, one brass. I'm from I'm going to butcher this, but Belize, I think. Yeah, Belize. Belize, okay. Yeah. Can I get a membership too? You absolutely can, yes. And what happens is PayPal, when you go to pay, wherever you're from, whatever a type of dollars you have over there, type of money, uh, PayPal will automatically transfer into U.S. dollars, so you don't have to do any extra work at all. PayPal does it all because it is amazing. But, guys, I'm just going to go for it. I'm nervous. Trying to make sure to get the whole thing. <laughs> uh, Hannah said, yes, Rachel, the HTV print and cut comparison video. Okay, yes, guys. So, um, I edited that uh, like a week ago. It is going up soon. I'm super pumped for you guys to see that one. It's going to be amazing. Um, so, stay tuned. I will try and update you the very day that it goes out or like a day before so you all can be raring to go for that because it's going to be pretty cool. But anyways, I think I've really done a number on this. So I'm going to put the cap back on. And I want to get our glitter, guys. I'm not even going to turn it around because I realize there's spray adhesive all over the place and I don't want to put it on the table. <laughs> so I'm just going to take this and I'm just going to sprinkle. Just sprinkle it away. Sprinkle away. Do, do we have any questions, though? You're more than welcome to ask. Um, what kind of Cricut do we use? We use a Cricut Maker, <coughs> excuse me, it's getting fumey in here. <laughs> uh, I love our Cricut Maker, but you totally can do a ton of stuff with your Cricut Explore or your Explore Air 2. We have those in the studio here as well. We have uh, both of those, and then we have the um, Martha Stewart one, the Explore Air 2. We absolutely love that one as well. So you guys can get crafty no matter what Cricut you use, but we are using the uh, Maker. Okay, this is glittery. This is a glittery mess. <laughs> Looky here. And look, we didn't use that much glitter. No. A couple people are asking about the Fall Summit. The Fall Summit, okay, okay. Let's do this. Joe, whip this camera around. While this takes a little second or two to I don't know what it's doing, uh, we'll just take a minute and talk about <laughs> the Fall Summit because I'm scared of this right here. <laughs> so anyways, guys, the Fall Summit is coming up October 12th and 13th. It is gonna be amazing. Now, if you don't even know what a summit is, what a virtual summit is, um, what it is is two days, October 12th and 13th, and it is two full days of a virtual crafting summit, which means you are watching me and Tanner at this table with this backdrop, 
uh, getting crafty, at least that's how it was in the spring one, and it's uh, 10 classes over two days, five classes a day, and you have 10 different teachers, or sometimes it's one person like me teaching two different classes, Tanner teaching two different classes, but we have a very wide variety of things that we teach. It is an amazing summit. We have at least about 250 people come every time. It is amazing, and we had a ton of people actually buy uh, tickets to this fall summit, before the spring summit was even over, all the people that were joining us, they were so, so excited. So what it is, is you watch it in the comfort of your own home with your comfy pants and eating your favorite snacks. And uh, you can just watch us get crafty and, you know, you can watch us or you can craft along with us because if you buy a ticket, not only do you get the uh, live stream and all the HD videos uh, that you watch that day, but you also get those HD copies to keep yourself forever. So you can really just hang out with us all day if you want to and then rewatch them later to really learn uh, how to do the techniques that we teach you in all the videos. Or you can craft along with us because we do give you a supply list a few months ahead. But that also brings me to my point about these guys. Okay, these craft kits everybody wanted so, so bad. So we only sent out 50 craft kits the past two summits and people were mad. So this year or this fall, we're going to give whoever signs up in the next, I think it's 10 days, um, craft kits. So I think you have 10 more days to sign up. So Joseph, uh, drop that link and just copy and paste that one more time, uh, in the bottom of the comments here and go get that link from Joseph. If you are not a member of makers going to learn, and that will take you to the sign up page where you can see all the crafty stuff going on there and you can get your ticket and get, uh, your secured spot to get one of these craft uh, packages. But if you are a member, go over to the Facebook group and it should be at the top. Uh, Tanner and uh, Tanner and I made a little video um, about the summit. You can go over there and get your special price there because you're a member, so you do get a special price for things like this. So go make sure you can get your craft kit because this stuff is this thing is chock full with a ton of stuff that is on your supply list that maybe is a little hard to find along with just some other goodies and bonuses that we want to give you all. So we only send out two packages a year to anybody and everybody and that is this, this right here. So we like to go all out with these and this year it's going to be even better than earlier in the spring summit. So make sure you secure a spot in that um, summit list and you get your ticket and you get your kit because there is a limited number of seats. I think we max out at about a 250. Uh, so go get that if you want to guys and you're missing out if you don't want to be a part of it because it's so much fun Where's it held at? It's held right here guys Right here and you guys are where you are you guys are at home Crafting you know in the comfort of your own home and the best part is guys Let's say you buy a ticket today because you know I know that a lot of people might want to say the earlier the better to get your craft uh, supply kit Excuse me spilled out all over myself. Haha, uh -huh. but Let's say you get your ticket today and closer to October, you realize that something has come up with your family or maybe you have to work uh, that weekend or something like that. But don't even worry, guys. You have not wasted your money. You still get your name in all the door prizes, all the giveaways while the summit is going on live. And you also, again, get those free HD copies of all the classes to keep for yourself forever. So even if you miss the Crafty Fun live that day, you still will get those classes um, for you to keep forever. And uh, that's one of my favorite things about it because my pet peeve about conferences is you pay a ton. Joseph has no idea what I'm talking about. He's just looking at me like conferences. I don't, I've been to No, one. You, okay, Joe. I've been to conferences. I'm what serious. type of conference did you go to? Not anything close to what y'all go to. I know, but I just have to have you say it because it's hilarious. So he owns a business. <laughs> He he uh, owns like a landscaping, uh, he mows lawns. Joseph will literally do anything you want him to do if it's outside, working hard, whatever. Mm -hmm. So me and Tanner and Courtney, we go to craft conferences. And Joseph, what conference did you go to? It's called the GIE Expo. That was in October. Mm -hmm. It's ba it's a big convention conference for all, anything la lawn care, landscaping. It's literally a, long, a lawn care conference. They have demos outside. You can go right around the lawnmowers Joseph or little was, excavators or anything you want. Joseph was sending us pictures and we were mm -hmm. dying. It was just little lawnmowers and everybody was just fawning over these lawnmowers. And he was in heaven. He was like a kid in a candy store. Mm -hmm. It's just so funny. But I, It's in October and I've already bought my tickets for this year. Have you? Yes. See, and, see, and I don't have the room and everything. I'm, I'm ready. It's hilarious. 
hilarious. But one of my pet peeves about conferences is that you have to buy your hotel, you have to buy the ticket to go, you have to run around, you have to get to your classes, and then once you're in your classes, you can't really try and make friends and socialize because you're running around, typing on your computer or what what may ever you do, write notes or whatever, uh, to try and get all the information to soak it in to get your money's worth. But with this virtual conference, with you guys chilling out, uh, watching us from the comfort of your own home, you don't have to be stressed about soaking in all the information or taking note of every single step Tanner does um, during his projects because again you guys get those videos to keep forever so it's like no stress it's a low stress environment it's super duper fun um, and it's a good time Joseph do we have any questions about that um, not about the summit okay but Paxson wants to know what kind of glitter you're using uh, glitter this is the cheap stuff from wait no this was not cheap stuff it was $4.99 which I don't think is a bad price um, this is either from Walmart or Hobby Lobby. What, usually what me and Tanner do when we have like a huge list of supplies, we hit Walmart first and then Hobby Lobby. So sometimes some craft supplies that we get at either places mold together in my mind. But this is either, I don't know if you, you know the difference, Joe. No. You don't know the difference between Walmart glitter and Hobby Lobby glitter? I'm sorry. Joseph. I'm, I'm learning. I'm appalled. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm joking. I'm I have so no sorry. idea. But um, it wasn't, and this is just like the thick glitter, chunky glitter. Um, it's not super fine glitter. So guys, I guess I'm going to pick this thing up and peel this thing off. I'm nervous, but here we go. Joseph, uh, if you want to switch cameras, sure. you can. Uh, Melinda asks, would it be possible to cut your own egg with the maker? Cut your own egg with the maker? Absolutely. Yeah, you could totally do that uh, with chipboard. It would just be pretty small. But okay, guys, I'm just going to, okay. Cute. So, whoa, I'm gonna scoop this up now. I don't wanna set it back down on this. <laughs> I'm gonna come over to this side here. I'm gonna set this down a little while I still hold it. I'm gonna get a Cricut tool. But yeah, you could totally cut this out of chipboard. That's a really good, that's a really good question. You could, it'd just be small because you know chipboard can only be like 11, 11 by 11. Oh no, did I mess up glitter right here? Oh, it's okay. A crawl asked, how much does the summit cost? So, again, I should have checked on this so I didn't have to, Oh man, I think it's in the link though. Yeah, so Joseph's gonna pop that link in the description. It was honestly a different price, I think, and I don't wanna give you guys the wrong price or anything like that. And uh, I know members do get a special, um, a special discount as well. So if you're a member, go to the Facebook group and uh, check out that link. Oh, okay, okay there, okay. So it's uh, 197 for uh, non-members, which is totally fine. God love Joseph's heart. He had to <laughs> he had to widen that, like zoom that in so big for me to see it because my eyes I'm blind. But it is I got one you. he he's got I me. Got you. But it is one ninety seven um, for non members uh, to have all those classes access to all those classes. Uh, but guys, I gotta let you in. On, it's not a secret because anybody can take part in it. But we also sell the classes after the summit, guys. But they are forty seven dollars a piece. So. It is most definitely uh, the best bang for your buck to go ahead and just get a summit ticket and join in on the crafty fun during the summit. It is so, so worth it. So I'm peeling this up, guys, and this is adorable. Laura asks, is it too late to get the discount for that? The discount for? The fall summit. The fall summit. So um, if you are a member, you can totally still get the discount. Go over there to the Facebook page and get that link. If you are not a member, we are not running sales uh, for that just yet. Maybe closer to the summit, maybe not. You can stay tuned, but honestly, guys, the craft kits that we give you too are very much worth going ahead and getting your summit tickets. You are not gonna wanna miss out on all the fun that we've got going on over there. So again, if you're a non-member, hit that link that Joseph is gonna pop in the uh, comments. If you are a member, go over to the Facebook group and enjoy that link and your special pricing. But guys, look at this. Look I, at this. Kathy said she's just tuning in. What type of vinyl did you use? So, Kathy, that's a great question. I just use some uh, scrap vinyl that, um, or you can also use stencil vinyl. There is stencil vinyl. But I just used some scrap vinyl from our scrap bin that I wasn't planning on using. It was like a uh, lime green, and that is just the color we do not use very much here. So we just use that as like the stencil here. But this is looking adorable. I'll come in a little bit closer and then we'll uh, switch to the other camera. But this is adorable. We just had a spray adhesive. And again, this is the spray adhesive we use. It's just Krylon spray adhesive. And I'll get a close up on the glitter for you guys too. Here's the glitter we use. We probably had some people asking for that as well. 
And again, it was $4.99. It's a big thing of glitter though. And I've used this on a lot of glitter mugs as well. Um, and this, this is looking great. Glitter tumblers, whatever they're called. Um, so I think it's from Walmart, but it might be from Hobby Lobby either or. But I'm going to very, very carefully set this guy over here on this easel. Very, very, very carefully. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Wow. Oh, wow. Did you see that? How cute. This thing's adorable. Okay. I'm just going to scoot this a little closer to me. Look how cute this is. Okay, guys. Let me know what you think. Okay. The, I did not, I was not able to test this product, project, excuse me, again, but I'm wiping the glitter off my arms. Watch me. Because um, I could not find any more of these at um, Target. But they're super cute. I love the like the wood look on the bunny that's kind of peeking out. Um, I love the texture of him. I love, um, excuse me, the color of glitter we chose. And you can choose any color of glitter. You can choose fine glitter of chunky glitter, whatever type of glitter you would like. Um, it's adorable. Corolla asks, will you be able to send the craft kit to Germany? Okay. My heart breaks every time I have to say this. It really, really does. My heart breaks. So, here's the thing, guys. We, we want to. We want to send outside the U.S. very, very much. But the problem is, when you send outside the U.S., prices go up and it extends the um, possibility of what is in the pack breaking or becoming damaged and things like that. And we really don't want to do that to you guys. Um, we don't want to see any products that are busted up or have to pay out the wazoo for it or anything like that. We really just want to try and make it as fair and as even as possible. And it'd be a shame if we paid all that money to send it to you guys and it did end up getting busted or something and it breaking or some paint, you know, going out of it. Now, Joseph used to work uh, for UPS, so he also knows that um, packages are thrown around sometimes, maybe a little bit, just a little bit. So you got to be careful, right. right, Joe? Definitely. You got to be careful with what you're packaging. And I'm sure he'll tell you, I know you're packaging it. He just dealt, dealt with the boxes already packaged. But whatever's in there, you just better make sure it's wrapped up good and tight, you know. So um, we do not send uh, out, outside the U.S. But if you maybe have a friend or a family member who lives in the U.S., we would be happy to send that to their address and have them send that to you. We just don't want to be liable if anything happens to that kit um, and sending that over uh, such a far distance. But that is a good question, and I'm really sorry to have to tell you that, though. Hmm. But Joe, what else we got? We have uh, anything else? Jenny says, add a cotton ball or a poof ball in the, for the tail, and it'll be perfect. Oh, my gosh. Heck, yeah. So, I'm also excited because we're going to be making, I don't know if I'm going to steal it from Tanner or if I'm going to let him make it. That's always my fight here is I make awesome projects for uh, these lives and Tanner does as well and Courtney does. But some of them that I make, I'm like, dang, that is adorable. I want to make that during the live. So sometimes I steal projects from Tanner and I'm like, you're not making that. I am. So it's a really, really awesome project. I really want to show it to you guys. I'm going to show it to you guys. I'm mm -hmm. going to show it to you guys. Okay. I'm only going to show it to you for a few minutes, like a few seconds. And the reason why I wanted to steal it from Tanner is because it's just so darn cute. But I do have to give credit to Tanner because, well, actually Joseph and Tanner, uh, because Joseph helped design and make these um, frames. And him and Tanner worked super hard together to make these awesome frames. So he'll be making the frame, but maybe I'll pop in and make the actual project. I'm just going to show you guys for like two seconds just on this camera. Look how cute. This is a pom-pom. Where is his butt? This is a pom-pom, <laughs> guys. Look how cute it is. But that's it. Nope, not going to show you guys anymore. Just a couple seconds. Let me know what you all think about that. It is with a, with a stencil. It is with paint. It is with vinyl. It's an awesome project. I had so much fun making it. Let me know what they say about that project. I think I'm going to steal that one from Tanner. But this turned out adorable, and I have so much glitter on the table. I'm going to get a paper towel here. Wipe this glitter off this table. Look at this glitter. But, guys, I love this project, how it turned out. If you want... To get a membership, guys, 20% off just until Tanner gets back. He might extend it through Sunday. Might. But, you know, who knows? He might not extend it through Sunday. Um, you get awesome things in that membership. We have went over it. Um, you get a ton of the membership. It is so, so worth it. We get questions all the time about what is the difference between our membership and Cricut Access. That is a good question. Um, so what I like to say when we are asked that is, 
that Cricut Access loves to give you awesome cut files and leave it at that. And they do have quite a large library of cut files, but with Makers Gonna Learn, you get the training videos, you get the e-courses, you get the fonts, you get the free commercial license of, for the yearly members, you get the printable guides for the yearly members. We, and then you get videos of me and Tanner here. You get us every day getting crafty. You get 24 seven customer support. You get the exclusive Facebook group, which is amazing and underrated guys. That Facebook group has like 2,600 people in it that are amazing, just sharing their crafty um, adventures, sharing all their projects. It is really amazing over there. We love it. And you guys will adore this membership. It is, we just want to lift each other up and get you all crafting, whether that's uh, just carving out some time in your busy lives to craft a few nights a week, or if that is quitting your job and picking up um, this membership and starting your own business, making money with your die cutting machine through the awesome advantages in the yearly membership. So no matter what type of crafty you're wanting to get, we just want to inspire you guys every day. So we also just want to say thank you so much because me and Joseph, me and Tanner, me and Courtney, the whole team could not ever be here uh, crafting with you guys, talking with you guys every day unless you all were here uh, purchasing that membership and supporting us so that we could support you. So thank you all for that because we couldn't do it without you. Um, but yeah, we just, we, we absolutely love what we do. I wouldn't trade my job for anything. You all are amazing. It's like one big family over here and Maker's Gonna Learn. If you want that 20% off membership, click the first link in the description below. It'll take you to the page that you can sign up. You can pick your tier, although I highly suggest you pick your yearly and you can either pay through PayPal or with a credit or debit card. So Joseph, what have we got? Uh, Mary, Jennifer, and Pat all, mm. all ask, would you or should you sell the project to prevent the glitter from shedding? And if so, what would you use? Okie dokie, guys. I would use a polyurethane. I would, I would actually go grab that now since I have a wireless mic and I can just run around. I'm just going to run around and get this polyurethane. And it is Minwax. I absolutely adore Minwax brand. I meant to grab this and show you all anyways. Amazing question, guys, though. So here it is. It's just Minwax fast drying. Let's switch the camera so we can show them, Joe. You know how we like it. So Minwax Fast Drying Polyurethane Clear Gloss. Here it is. It's not super, um, super expensive and it's, it's good stuff. So um, we use this, but you also need to let this dry. So after like 30 minutes to an hour, take this bad boy outside or get your pitiful little craft board again, your little poster board, um, and spray a good heavy coat with this. Now, if you wanted to do what that member said, and take you a big pom-pom and hot glue it on the little bunny butt. You can totally do that, but do it after you seal it. So seal it once if you think the glitter is going to fall off or whatever, seal it again. But yes, I would absolutely seal this. Just make sure this dries enough so you don't like suffocate it while it's trying to dry all the glitter and stuff. But no, that is a great point. I would most definitely seal it. Uh, Minwax Fast Drying Polyurethane Clear Gloss. It says super durability, long lasting protection. Sold Minwax. <laughs> So we love this product here too. And again, we use the Krylon spray adhesive, men wax, and then of course our little alcohol that we love here. But what else we got, Joe? As Stephanie asks, if I get a monthly membership now and upgrade next month, do I still get 20% off? You do not. No, you get grandfathered in for the tier that you join at. So if you join at the monthly and you cancel your monthly and upgrade to yearly, you will not get 20% off because you joined and got grandfathered in at the monthly rate. So I, I do highly suggest going ahead and investing in that yearly membership because again, you do get grandfathered in. I haven't said that enough today that you do get grandfathered in. So no matter how many years your membership rolls over, it will always be 20% off because you joined during this sale, which is amazing. And because you guys pour into us for 365 days, we pour into you yearly members. So you get everything we have to offer. I know you are so sick of hearing it, but we do not pull out any stops. We give you all every resource that we have. Uh, like the one member was asking, I think it was Candace. She was wondering, she was a yearly member and she thought maybe there were some hidden cut files or this or that. No, if you're a yearly membership, your dashboard is chocked full with everything that we have and more stuff coming in the works. Your yearly members, we just pour into you because you pour into us. 
So that's a good question. I think I go on too many rabbit trails answering a question and answering four more. But hey, that's just me, guys. I'm sorry. Tanner's quick and to the point that I'm most definitely not. But that is a good question. You do get a grandfathered in at the tier you join. So get a yearly if you want to get um, grandfathered in for that yearly. Definitely. Joseph? Anything else? I believe that's about it. You believe that's about it? I believe so. What? What? Did they not say anything about a cute little bunny project? They said they love it. Okay, good. They, okay. they said they like, like it better than this project. Well, th duh. <laughs> yep. Well, this was like a spray piece of glitter, guys. That's adorable. It uses our Raiden inspired font and a little bunny, and then I put a little butt on it with a pom pom. How could that not be cuter than this? Okay, just saying. It was adorable. I don't know when we're going to make that. Uh, jo Joseph, uh, not Joseph, too many J's. <laughs> I wasn't even trying to say a J name. Tanner needs to make us a new frame for that, though, but I think he might want to make one during the live. I don't know. So he might have to steal that from me, but when you guys see that, and if he's making it, you better say that's Rachel's project and we know it because it is, but he made the frame, which I guess is a big part of it. But guys, anyways, I hope that you all have an amazing day. Um, if you don't have any more questions, please go get your membership for 20% off. Tomorrow might very well be the last day because Tanner will be here with Joseph on Saturday. And I don't know if he'll be raring to go to give you guys that sale again. So there Joseph goes. <clears throat> Before I even have to ask, Joseph's on top of it, uh, throwing out that link for you guys. So it's in the first link down below in the description or Joseph as Tanner Bell. Just pop that into the comments. So guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that you all had a good crafty time. I had a ton of fun making this project. It was adorable. I love the way it turned out. I was a little nervous because I hadn't tested it just because again, we couldn't find any more of these. Now we haven't looked um, in the last little bit. Uh, there's not a Target close to us. It's like an hour away. So we went and looked a couple months ago and they just have like a little bit of spring stuff out. So not that much spring stuff, but Go check now and there might be. So if so, buy a ton of these because these are great. Vinyl went on it way better than I thought so. This adhesive, uh, the spray adhesive worked great on it. And if you see any like little uh, specks in the bunny where you don't want it, just get you a dry paintbrush and sweep it off before you a polyurethane and you will be good to go. But any more questions? Uh, Candace says, y'all are amazing. Have a great day. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Candace. You're amazing. Thank you. You have a good day. And I hope you all have a great day. So me and Joseph... We'll be here the same time tomorrow. Hopefully, I will have a different shirt on and my hair will be washed just for you guys. <laughs> so, I cannot wait to uh, see you guys and hang out with you guys tomorrow morning. So, I guess we'll see you later. You have a great rest of your Thursday and I'll see you on Friday. Bye, guys.